it going guys, it's Mac. I'm currently sitting in Cherry Bomb. And about two months ago, we installed the Victory 4x4 Molly panels in the Tacoma. And so I wanted to give you an update. They are fully filled out with what I'm gonna use them for. And they'll probably change a little bit over time, but I wanted to show you what they look like today. All right, so starting on the driver's side, this is what we're looking like over here. So obviously on the far left we have a fire extinguisher, and this is from First Alert. Uh, it's really important to carry a fire extinguisher, especially when you're doing with anything like equipment related, like off-road and stuff like that. Crazy things can happen, and it's good to have one on you. These two pouches right here, these are uh, originally designed for double M4 rifle magazine pouches, but then I've obviously repurposed them. So this pouch right here I call my triage pouch. So I've got a tourniquet and a Kershaw knife here, which just allows me to be able to help someone out in an unfortunate circumstance. I do have some medical training being in the military, and so I'd be able to lend a hand with that. Right next to it, obviously you can tell we've got a radio in here. We've just got a bow thing in here with an extended battery and a Code Red headset uh, shoulder mic, a push to talk. And then to the right of that, we have a Benchmade strap cutter. So again, unfortunate circumstance, roll over something crazy, which these things do happen and that's why we've got that right there. But that's about it on this side, and now let's move over to the passenger side. All right, moving on to the passenger side, not as eventful, only got two pouches here. This pouch here, I think it was originally designed for a machine gunner's box magazine, but I use it as a giant cup holder. So if you have any of these bigger Hydro Flasks or the bigger Yetis, um, they don't like any of the normal size cup holders. So they do make like extenders that can basically go in the cup holder and becomes bigger to hold like a hydro flask or a yeti but i thought of this idea and this was actually one of the main reasons that i bought these is because i always like having tons of water and so this allows it to just hang out in there and then also this can close up over the top so that way whenever i'm off-roading and bouncing around it won't fly out next to it we have a usmc ifac pouch which i don't have a whole lot of medical supplies in there for the time being but just a few things, and I definitely want to add to this. This is something where definitely there will be some expansion in the future. And that's about it. The cool thing about the Molly panels is, is that if you ever want to change things up, you totally can. You can change it up for based on the trip you're going on or if you're just going to be in the city for a while and all that jazz. So I really like it. I think in the future I definitely want to add more stuff to that medical pouch and more stuff like that because there's barely anything in there right now. I definitely want to get some like shears and other stuff like that. But I think it's a good start. Everything that was on my wish list of things that I wanted to put on here are on there. So now the radio has a dedicated spot to be. Uh, I've got a tourniquet. I've got my strap cutter. I've got the fire extinguisher handy, which was like in the bench seat in the back. So it was like, even like if I needed to get to it quick, I usually on a trip have stuff on top of the bench. So it was super impractical where I was at. The water bottle pouch and then the medical pouch, like I said, I want to add to that. So that's about it. Just a quick video to give you an update of how I'm using it and to give you guys some ideas. Leave a comment down below of what you would put in that medical pouch. I know there's a lot of experienced guys in the community and I want to know what you think. But that's about it. Thank you guys so much for watching. God bless. We'll see you guys next time. Bye. So it's been about three or four months and now we're going to talk about them. It's not been three or four months, it's been. And that's about it. It's really cool.